Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks. And somebody, I did a video the other day about the envelope tool and putting word into a shape. I think it was the, maybe the pumpkin. And they commented that they don't have the icons that I have, and I didn't know what he was really talking about. So I had him send me a screenshot. He's got X7, I added that. This is his screenshot. And you can see he doesn't have these three icons. I don't really know what, this is just to keep lines, which that is. So this is X7, this is X19, they've changed it up. This is create an envelope form from form. So when you do this, you just take your text, go to vertical, click on that, and then you get that arrow and you pop it in there. In X7 or below, you would have this, and then you would go to your eyedropper tool and put your eyedropper in there and it's gonna make that shape. I do not have X7 anymore, I'd, I'd show you. So this is the keep lines. This is copy envelope to another property, which this just doesn't, uh, X7 just didn't have, so they've added that. But I've still got, you've got everything I've got. You can uh, add a preset and get your presets. And you can start a new, you've got to add new. So everything's the same except for the eyedropper and you've got to reset and apply where and I just tried, I have X7 on an older computer. I just went and did it and it worked. Right here, it's gonna ask you to do this. Well, on this, you'd hit the eyedropper and then these are gonna light up and you hit apply. Because I think you do that because that way you can change from putty to vertical, horizontal, or original. So I hope that answered this question and thank you for watching.